and I will be conducting the first part of our virtual Zipline tour. Um, the first thing you need to know is in the first couple of days of you being at school, you will be given a lanyard. This is very important. You have to wear it every single day. It has to be around your neck. It can't be any, in any of your pockets. Um, the lanyard is very useful because it will help you come into school or out of school during, uh, so not peak flow, so not before or after school. So if you have a study and you want to go into town or go home, then you can use this to get out of school. Um, this is the reception area. Um, you have to wear a mask when you are going around the corridors. So we have the entrance here to go, which you are allowed in. And this is the exit to come out because we need a one way system. So let's go. Make sure you wear your mask. This is the reception area. Um, we have Amy here to talk to you about Saffron Hall. So this is the, the entrance to Saffron Hall in which many professional concerts are held. It's an independently run company to the school, but we also get to use the hall both as a study area during the daytime and as part of a music academy. Some people do master classes with people in there and concerts are held in there. And um, so we will continue this way. We to Sue's Cafe next. Right, we're heading to Sue's Cafe. Um, this is the entrance to the sixth hall. Uh, so if we head down here, we will meet Ashley and Florence, who are going to tell us about Sue's Cafe. Hi, welcome to Sue's Cafe. This is where you can get food, snacks, and hot drinks. which is usually open from period two to the end of lunchtime, so you can come in your study period, break, or lunch. Um, we'll move on. So you can head down from here. This is the entrance to um, the sixth form centre. Uh, here we have Adam to explain a little bit about what's going on down here. So just by the main doors to the sixth form bathrooms are the male, female, and disabled toilets, along with the water fountain just here, which is the main one to the form, but there's also one in the common room. And out here, sort of courtyard area with some picnic benches which is quite a nice spot if it's good weather of course to do a bit of work or that sort of thing and then down here it says the main chair um, so you come down here this is where the sixth centre is here we have Frankie hello I'm Frankie and I'm going to talk to you about Sixth Form Centre so we've got S1 in there and then some more around the corner we've got more toilets here and um, so in S block we usually have the social sciences, downstairs we'll have economics, business, uh, you know, sociology, psychology, we've got the geology room, uh, the temple of geology if you will, uh, lots of rocks, lots of, um, you know, there's a hard hat, lots of displays and things, um, there's usually a big blow up dinosaur in here but I don't know where he's gone. Um, and then if you follow down, there's some more down here, so we'll have, yeah, sociology, RE, philosophy is in here as well, um, some history and geography also, is that anyone? Yeah. Uh, this I think is a politics room and a history room, so we've got a Boris Johnson cutter and I think Nick Clark? Yeah. I don't know, I don't um, And then... If we head upstairs to um, the upstairs and downstairs, and also some other steps as well, which you can go down so we haven't got too much congestion. Hello, so this is the upstairs of the S corridor. Here we have some more cor uh, some more rooms, just like downstairs. As we come along here, we've got a nice film studies room, uh, which has great facilities, better than most schools. Um, it's absolutely lovely. Uh, as, as we come down this corridor here, we've got some staff rooms, um, um, and more rooms for just general learning, for business studies, and, uh, such like, um, and as we turn this corner here, we get to the study cafe. I like it. <laughs> right, we're going to show you the study cafe slash uh, common room. Yeah. Um, so this is um, a social area as well as an area where we can get food. So if you're not working in here, or if you are working in here, you can 
also accompany that with um, hot foods, cold foods, drinks, and loads of stuff like that. Yeah, we have a nice little area around here as well. Um, yeah, so lots of selections. We have like salads and pasta and there's sandwiches, lots yeah. of drinks, snacks, everything you could possibly ever want. And this area is really good for also um, studying between lessons, um, so hopefully you'll get to use it a few times um, if you just need that extra more sociable space to concentrate yeah. before. Yeah, you have to be silent in. Yeah. Um, and then we'll have later to live, we will take you through some of the more quiet study areas. So this is our study centre, we'll sit for our own lunch. And there are computers and a silent study space for people to use during their free to like revision and home life and stuff. Um, so these are our computers. You can come here whenever you want. Uh, and we have our sick form offices here, so the year 12 office and the year 13 office. So you can ask anyone any questions, if you have any, or if you need some help, you can go and talk to them. Um, so these are the computers, and we have a little section here if you need to work, but you don't need a computer. Um, as well as the chairs and tables here in the silent group study area. Um, so yeah, you can go in your own phrase, do your homework, do your revision, and it's really helpful. Um, so that was the sixth form.